So a friend came over to my house about a week ago and he had bought an iPhone 11 Pro Max from the US uh, and I know there have been like plenty of, the phone has been out for three months, there are plenty of videos, unboxing videos, most of which you've already watched, but I really wanted to share the experience and if you still clicked on this video, I, I sincerely appreciate it. But this is a Silver 11 Pro Max uh, and it's 256 gigabyte in capacity so 1 lakh rupees even though it's even though it's been bought from the US it's 1 lakh rupee worth of phone <sighs> but bagair kisi kidney ke jokes ke let's actually unbox I don't see the point why most of the unboxing videos showcase all the rest of the stuff that you get inside the box apart from the phone. I'll just give you a roundup. Lightning cable, ear pods, slightly faster, wall plug. Oh and also... So this is a matte finish now. Every iPhone 11 Pro has a matte finish glass at the back now. I think it's a better choice. It, it feels slightly better in my opinion. But the white color... Actually, the camera rings, they go really well with the white, they contrast really well. But uh, I'm a bit disappointed by the Apple logo. I just wanted it to be slightly more visible. I want to show off a little bit. And also the silver frame. I mean, I used iPhone 10 use kiya tha, which two years ago. There were a lot of scratches. Aa gaye. So I'm a bit skeptical about this too. But for the most part, it's pretty sexy. Setting up the iPhone is... A whole different story. Our net didn't work, so we didn't have Apple ID set up. So we had to restart and uh, do it all over again without the Apple ID. But one thing that I that I found in uh, set it, while setting up the iPhone was dark mode. iOS 13 dark mode. iOS 13 ki ek hi speciality is dark mode. And it's actually slightly better on any iPhone with an OLED screen because with in an OLED display, to display black, the pixels just don't light up at all so that's true black it also helps in saving battery baki sub was all the same except for the display which it is extremely bright the highest brightness is crazy it's 1200 nits i suppose i use an iphone 7 so it's a massive difference also the 11 pro max size i, I don't know why i didn't talk about this earlier but the 11 pro max size is not as big it's almost as big as the OnePlus 6, but since the bezels are so tiny, it feels massive. Uh, but if you do have a bulky case, it will, it will, it, that, then that, that to will be very big in the game. Otherwise, it's, it's pretty sweet. So I had a very brief time with the camera and the wide angle lenses and the telephoto lens. I didn't get to capture any images, but one thing that I found in the viewfinder was the changing white balance or colors for each and every different camera sensor and uh, with iPhone what you see in viewfinder is what you generally get outside. I did read on Twitter that a few other people have experienced this but you know what it's fine most of the people are happy with the iPhone 11 Pro Max terrible name great battery life fast charging great design uh, not a, not an ugly design to me at least not as ugly as the renders and that's about it that's the iPhone 11 Pro Max unboxing three months later. Thank you for watching this video. If you're still here, it means a lot. Uh, it's kind of a pointless video, I know. It's just a fun little pointless video. But I had a nice time. And I'll talk to you in the next one. We are actually moving, by the way. Just saying. So lots of videos incoming. Talk to you in the next one. Bye.